Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Lauren. I hope that you're all continuing to stay healthy and safe and well and continuing to look out for one another and just show love and kindness to one another. It's such a crazy time going on right now. So really just do your best to stay healthy and to stay safe. So I'm really excited about today's video because I'm going to show you how you can use your smaller SLGs as handbags. So I'm going to show you different chain options that you can use. I'm also going to show you some accessories to kind of jazz up your small leather goods or your handbags. Um, as you know, I really like mini bags and I typically only use mini bags. So being able to take something like the pochette accessoire from Louis Vuitton and turning it into a handbag. So not just like a little like handheld or like uh, over the shoulder bag, but actually into like crossbody is really exciting for me. Um, so I am going to be showing you all the different options. I will be showing you how you can put different accessories on bigger bags too. So if that interests you, then just stay tuned. So all the accessories and the bag chains that I'm going to show you today are from a Canadian brand called Next Fashion and they're based out in Toronto which is so awesome because I love being able to support Canadian brands and the owner of the brand, his name is Paul, he's like a young entrepreneur, he's so nice, he's so kind, like I find like, I feel like that's really hard to find in today's world, <laughs> just someone who's genuinely nice um, and he is just one of those really great people. So um, he messaged me on Instagram. I'm a fairly small YouTuber, but I surprisingly get a lot of people asking to send me things. And I just don't do it because it doesn't fit with, I feel like my channel. And if it's not something that I personally like, then I just feel like, why would I want you guys to buy it? Or why would I want to show it off? Anyway, so I went to his site and he has amazing things and he has a lot of reviews. So I was reading through his reviews and um, they're all really positive. So I thought this is something that goes with my channel and something that I feel like my subscribers would like and um, why not do it? So he said I could choose one chain, so I did, and he custom sized it for me, which he can also do for you, which is so awesome. And then he told me, he's like, I'm going to send you just a couple of other things. And he sent me a lot. <laughs> he sent me so much. He's just such a nice, kind, generous person. Next Fashion also ships to the US as well as internationally and you can go on the website and change the currency so that way you can see how much the bag chains as well as the shipping will cost you. Um, so I'm going to show you everything now and I feel like it's really affordable. Like I said, it is Canadian and you can um, sort of choose your sizes and it goes up in price but it's very affordable. I feel like compared to something like HRH collection which can be a little bit expensive. I did look into um, some of her bag chains and they would be $200 Canadian by the time I did the currency converter. So without further ado, let me just show you these bag chains and accessories because I've been talking about them forever and I haven't showed you anything yet. But I will also mention that there will be a 20% off coupon down below and I will link everything for you as well so if you just want to hit the link directly and go to the site um, and then you can also do that but yeah coupon code down below for 20% off so I think that's an amazing deal because like I said they're already all affordable as it is so we're gonna start off with the one that I had um, asked for and it is this one here and this is the braided purse chain and it is in seven millimeter like the thickness of it it is substantial like I don't know how I can show you how substantial it is but you can probably hear it I guess I could weigh it if you really want me to because I have a scale but um, it's just like this beautiful kind of gold color and then these are the clasps so you do have an option with the clasps you can choose like this sort of small hook which is very reminiscent of the Louis Vuitton one let me show you a Louis Vuitton sort of hook so this one is from my pochette accessoire. You can kind of see it there. And it's essentially the exact, it's a little bit smaller. This is the one from Next Fashion. So, but it has the same kind of clasp. So it opens up this way. You can also get like a larger clasp. You can get like a little circle ring. There's different options. So you're not really stuck with just getting one type of clasp. You can choose and you can also choose your length. And he has a reference. So if you're, you know, five, 
two and under, you're five, five and over. He has a recommendation, but like I said, I customize mine. I like to wear my bags fairly high up, which you'll see in the try on. Um, but this was the first one, and like I said, this was the braided purse chain, and this one starts at $17.99 um, for the shortest length, and then it does go up in price, but I mean, it's gorgeous. It's so, so nice. And let me show you really quickly the bag chain that I had, because the quality compared to um, Next Fashions and Paul's brand is just, it's like crap. <laughs> Um, okay, so this was the bag chain I was using. I just had to take it off my niece, but look at the clasp. So this was the clasp on the bag chain I'm using. Like, I'm not even touching it. Like, look at how cheap this thing is. And it just like, <laughs> it's just so cheap and it was really hard to like open. Um, so yeah, this was the bag chain I'm using. And if you compare the two, like you can tell a difference between the two. So um, this was the first one and this is the one that I had asked for. So I'm gonna show you sort of how you can use it and you can style it. Like I said, this is the braided purse chain. So here is the braided purse chain on. I am about 5'5", five five, and like I said, I like my bags to hit fairly high up, so I did customize the length, which you can do. Uh, you can also wear this just on the shoulder if you want. I feel like it would also hit at a pretty good height, so, or a pretty good length. Next purse chain that he gave me is called the oval purse chain, and this one is six millimeters. It again has the same clasp, and he did um, custom sizes for me so mine is 40 inches long like I said and so there's the first so this is the braided purse chain that I showed you first and then this is the oval purse chain the oval purse chain is a little bit lighter I would say so if you don't want something as heavy then this would be nice for you just added the Rolo purse chain onto my mini pochette and it actually matches the hardware fairly well. So this is another way that you can um, change your little SLG into a handbag. I think this is just so cute. You can use this if you're just going out to really quickly run some errands. And then this is the most popular one that's on his site. This is the curb chain in the nine millimeter. And I feel like this is very reminiscent to a lot of like the purse chains that you find with, um, so for example, I had a Givenchy Pandora um, and it had like this kind of curb chain. So I find that this is really popular. Like I said, on his website, this has sort of the most reviews. And then this is a nine millimeter. I think he does also have like um, a wider one if you want. Again, it's 40 inches and it has the small kind of clasp. So let me show you the three together. So this is the first one I showed you, the braided, this is the oval, and then this is the curb chain. So here is the curb chain on my pochette accessoire. This one hangs a bit lower because the pochette has these sort of an extra like inch and a half, I guess you would say right here with their um, attachment. But it does look a little bit flat because it is empty, but I do like how this one sits. This is the heaviest chain um, of all three, but it's fairly comfortable and lightweight. All right, so the next chain I'm gonna show you is called the light curb chain. So it's a little bit lighter. So this was a curb chain that I showed you here. This one is a little bit lighter, even though it is thicker. This is 12 millimeters. It's just like a lighter sort of weight, which I find is really nice. And it has these kind of O-ring kind of clasps that open up like this. I'm so excited for this one and to show you how you can use it because I just think that this is going to be so versatile. You can use it as a top handle. You can use it to accessorize bigger bags. It's just, this is so cute. And this one starts at, well, this one I think only comes in one length. I could be wrong. He can definitely, like I said, he can definitely um, customize it for you, but this is $26.99. All right, and here is the light curb chain. You can see I've just added it on to my Nano Niece. So essentially now I have it as like a little handheld. So you can just put it in the crook of your arm like that, or you could also just sort of carry it like this, which I think is so cute. And like I said, this chain is a little bit of a lighter weight, so it's not uncomfortable. Um, I feel like if you were to load this up, it would get a little bit heavy, but because the bag chain is nice and light, it's still really comfortable. So here I've added that same curb chain to my Speedy B, and I just think that this makes it look so cute. 
it's just a nice little accessory you can add on. Again, here's that same light curb chain and I've added it onto my Goyard and it's just, this chain is so versatile. You can use it in so many different ways to accessorize or you can just use it as a top handle for other bags. So I think that this also looks really cute. So options people, you got options with this one. I realized I'm really bad at leaving the prices of everything because I've only done it for like half of the things. But like I said, I will leave everything linked down below and I will also put something on the screen so you know what I'm talking about. So the next purse chain he sent me, which is also like a smaller sort of top handle or accessory is this one here. And this is the Rolo purse chain. And this is um, 11 millimeters, I believe. So again, you can use it as um, like a little cute top handle or you can use it as an accessory. So here is the oval purse chain. Again, this is a little bit thicker. I think this is 11 millimeters, but again, it's so nice and light. I just have it on my pochette accessoire and you can wear it in the crook of your arm really easily too. All right, so now I'm gonna move into a couple of wristlets that he sent me as well. Like there's so much he sent me. I, I can't believe it. I still can't believe it when I look at everything. Um, so I showed you the nine millimeter curb chain. He also sent me it in wristlet form. So you can add this to your small leather goods. So you can carry it as a wristlet like this. You could also use this as a keychain. I feel like, which would be so cute. So you can attach your keys to this if you wanted to. Um, but again, it has that sort of smaller clasp there and it's the same as the actual chain I showed you earlier. It's just in a wristlet form. So here is the curb chain and I've just attached it to my pochette accessoire. So now I have it as a cute little wristlet and I think this just works really nicely if you want to dress this bag up a little bit more as opposed to just using the leather strap that it comes with. And because mine was pre-loved, it's pretty um, dark the patina so I do like this option and then this is a little bit of a longer wristlet the next one I'm going to show you right now is the braided wristlet and this one as you can see is a little bit shorter so it's really up to you and your style but you can also customize it um, so this is what the braided one looks like oh this one looks really nice with it too and then this one's very comfortable I feel like because this one's a little bit shorter it might be better for me I swear I'm almost done is showing you everything that he sent me but like I said he was so generous and he sent me so many things so thank you so much Paul um, so the next two things are you can see this one here they're just little keychains so there's one with the bigger rings so you can do your keychain like that or there's one with a smaller ring so two different keychains there, two different size clasps, as you can see. So this one on the right is fairly large, whereas this one's the smaller clasp. And then I also got one of these. So when I first saw this, I was like, oh, what is this? And I looked on the site, this is for the luggage tag. So here is the luggage tag attachment that I've just put on. So that's so much more helpful than having to undo the strap all the time. So it just makes it easy to um, switch it on from bag to bag. So I typically only wear this on my speedy. So there you go. It just lies like that. But again, if you just want to move it to your Neverfull or if you want to actually move it to your um, key ball, then it's really easy to just take on and off and it just hangs nicely. You don't have to worry about it getting twisted or anything like that. All right, so that is everything that Paul sent me. And like I said, there was just so much stuff because he's so nice and generous. Um, I will leave his website down below as well as his, as his Instagram. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them down below. And until I see you in my next video, continue to stay healthy and safe and have a great day. Bye.